Ishaq from India says, he wants to get married, he's young, he doesn't know how to speak to his parents. Well, you are one of millions of young men, Muslim men who are interested in getting married but can't do that. The Prophet والسلام, was realistic when he addressed the youth and he said, Oh, youth, oh young people, whoever among you is capable of getting married physically and financially, then he should do so. Now, if you are physically, and I hope you are, capable of getting married, are you financially capable of getting married? The answer is no. You don't have a job. You're still at college, maybe at high school. So who will provide for you? If your father is not convinced that you are a real man and you're capable of assuming the responsibility was, uh, uh, responsibilities of a husband, he will not help you financially. In this case, you have to follow the realistic uh, um, advice of the Prophet ﷺ when he continued to say, and whoever is unable to get married, he must fast. So in your case, if you cannot financially support yourself in getting married, you can fast every alternate day. This would curb your sexual desires until you start to earn. Either after graduation or if you get into business or if you get a job. But you need to earn so that you can open a house for your wife. If your father is rich and he is a logical person and has high levels of intellect, he would appreciate that my 18 years old son has to get married because there is so much fitna outside. And I ask any father, if you were in your son's shoes, what would you do? If you were to, give, to be given the choices of fasting, getting married, or having a girlfriend and fornicating, what would you choose? Mm. Rarely you would find people fasting because they're not brought up to be practicing Muslims. And if, even if they were to fast every alternate day, the moms and the fathers would probably be on his case. What is this? This is extreme. You're going to kill yourself. Guys, what do you want me to do? Masturbate? Go and fornicate? So many girlfriends I can party with and do haram things and fall into zina. This is why the whole environment, the whole society is unfortunately corrupt. They call you to do haram. They facilitate haram for you. But when it comes to get, getting married, no. So if I have a, a wife, I'd like to get a, a married again, the whole community is against me. Okay, if I want to go and travel to some other country and get a girlfriend there, it's okay. It's a couple of weeks and come back a year. There's no problem. No strings attached. And this is a very wrong misconception about what life is. As Muslims, we have hell and fire waiting for us. So what we do in this world reflect on our uh, uh, fate, on, on, on where we will end up at the end of the day. So, Akhi, all what I can do is best of luck, but you have to you know, try to convince your father. If not, then there's no way other than uh, fasting alternate day.